Hi and welcome. So, doing a basic Django app, and I've taken most of the code from uh, Real Python, and they've got a GitHub repo where they've shared most of this code. So, basic uh, uh, Celery, Django, Redis, and scheduling tasks. So, what is happening? The primary task is to download these pictures uh, from Flickr, and the secondary task is this feedback form which is there a very simple uh, feedback form so you go ahead and give some feedback you say feedback and submit and uh, where do you track this you can see it happening here so this is basically redis and redis is sending the task sending due task so which is task save latest flicker image so where have we defined this task we defined this task in the uh, task.py file for that particular uh, application and we've got two of these task.py file one for the feedback one and one for the photos one and uh, i've kept most of the code same i have not changed anything over here leaving aside the duration uh, so how many times uh, within a minute or say within an hour or within a day uh, should you go ahead and download those pics so this is the periodic task decorator and uh, that is what is difference between the task and the periodic periodic task that you can from celery decorate decorators you can import either one of them and to understand as to how we can schedule these periodic tasks uh, this is the link we can go ahead and have a look over there and now this is every minute that it's getting downloaded and this is the logger info so they basically a success message that would come in which would say okay fine this is what is happening here uh, and this is where you get to see that it says uh, hey Dhanka saved yet another image from Flickr and it's happening after every minute. So you're getting images after every minute. And uh, that is the scheduled task. And basically uh, taken it from here, from real Python, uh, Pika, and uh, rest of it from Celery project. So very simple uh, project, a basic project which shows as to how to use Redis, Celery, and Django. Uh, not Rabbit MQ yet. So let me uh, do a few things and get back uh, with the rabbit MQ also. I probably want to do a longer uh, video with a more uh, complex project and some tasks which can be done. And probably put it on uh, Heroku or Python Anywhere or one of those and host it over there in production. So right now the, these are the three tasks which are there and these tasks can be picked up by salary from absolutely any app that we create so we can create a new app I put a task.py file in that a task can be absolutely any function can be simple addition multiplication sending an email out anything of that sort and what we need to do is we need to make sure that we've gone ahead and installed redis and celery uh, on our system and uh, then we run two different uh, we run two different shells after we've gone ahead and run our server and in one shell we've gone ahead and given this command which is uh, the info command you see over here celery a pika worker so that pika is basically the name of the project so whatever is the name of your project uh, you go ahead and give that command and uh, so installing redis installing celery uh, making sure that your django application you go ahead and make those changes in your settings.py file. So that was already there. So I've gone ahead and made some other changes uh, in the settings.py. I have not necessarily uh, changed anything much over here. So this is the celery, uh, this thing. So you, you, the celery broker is Redis. The default, this thing is localhost 6379. Uh, what kind of content you are serializing, JSON. Time zone I've retained as that only so it doesn't necessarily make a difference. You're not running it in production right now. 
running it and these are those two apps feedback and photos for both these apps we have a, a tasks.py file so this is what it looks like the tasks.py file and this is the original repo on github so what you can do is you can go and have a look there and uh, wonderful uh, guidelines are there so it's pretty simple it's 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 pretty popular also yeah so that's about it thanks